Hi everybody, just a quick update on how how this is progressing. So I'm just plumbing in a radiator right now and uh, I got the, we all know this is in the, I just need this uh, engine to run in the shop and to test uh, the fuel and introductory, uh, well I have, never mind that. So it's temporary permanent radiator fixtures. Of course, uh, this, don't worry, the two by fours were repurposed from uh, or salvaged from literally a barn. I'm just mounting the radiator hoses right now. Um, of course, going from an inch and a quarter to huh, everything else. Uh, downtown, I was able to find a hose that almost worked. It just had to be reclocked, right? Like. This was pointing maybe this way or something. So I just jumped a union in there and turned it. And the other half of that hose is down here. And I got the same thing going on. It's a little short and it's not clocked just right. So of course we'll put a, um, do the same thing. Then I'll establish top dead center with this I don't know if I trust the timing marks. I guess they're there at all, but uh, I'll establish that. Fill the radiator up full of fluid and uh, see if, what we got going on there. And um, this, this engine's good. <coughs> Excuse me. I'm gonna go with the, with the GEEP type system. So the exhaust, uh, the flange was made and uh, use a V-style clamp, right? So that when the, when that bolts on here, I can turn it, orientate it whichever way. And also I can, it can come off of there as many times as it needs to without, uh, you know, it's just a matter of undoing one clamp and it's off of there. So this needs to be welded. I don't know if you weld it in there or wherever that's gonna end up. I just there just needs to be enough threads to spin a fitting on this end left. So like probably maybe somewhere even around there. Weld that in, cut it. The other end there's gonna be a 90 degree elbow coming out of here. So that'll complete that circuit. There's the other end of that V coupling. I guess I could just show you how that works. Oh. It's gonna go on there like, well, if it didn't just fall off of there like that. So like there, and down there. But if for whatever reason, I could also spin it around here and uh, and use it that way. And then in, in the shop, it might be, that might, might happen. It'd be easier to uh, uh, access everything if it was on this side on the dead side I yeah well that's that's where I'm at right now so okay talk to you later